Hey Terra Uniters! In this video I'm going to be teaching you how to give your friends or whoever you want condo admin. Alright, so to begin giving your friends condo admin, the first step you want to do is type in Windows and R at the same time. And then it will bring up this little prompt over here. And what you want to do is just copy what I put in here. And don't worry, you don't have to type all that out if you don't want to. I'll make sure to put it in the comments and in the description. That way you just don't need to be bothered with all that. Uh, because I know I would not want to uh, type all that in myself. Anyway, with that aside, when you get that ready, you'll want to click over here and do OK. And it will bring up this little folder for Tower Unite, and it will have a bunch of files, but the one you're looking for is called Tower Server. And if you don't have that, it's completely OK. What you can do is you can make a new text file over here, and it's case sensitive, so you'll want to name that Tower Server as well. And then when you get that ready, you'll want to go inside that file. And then it will have this little thing up here that says administ or bracket administration bracket. And then you'll want to go to a new line and type in admin steam ID equals. And then you'll want to type in whatever your friend's steam ID is. And if you don't have your friend's steam ID, don't panic. It's completely okay. I know I didn't. Uh, what you can do is you can go to your friend's profile that you're trying to give admin. And if it's a common name like my friend Saf, you can do copy page URL and go to a little site over here called Steam IDIO. And if you go into Lookup and put their Steam page, it will show the Steam page that you're looking for. And you can just go confirm that right here. That's her page. And then what you want to click is Steam ID 64 over here. So I'll copy that to my clipboard. And since I want to add a new person, I'll do another line that says Steam ID equals. And then now there's her ID. After this, I'll just save that little file, I'll get out of here, out of here, and then we have that file with the um, everybody's name and everything, and mine is already an INI file with the configuration stuff, but if you need to make yours an INI file, you should be able to just add a dot INI to the end of the document and it will convert it, but if that doesn't work, it's completely okay, I had the same issue. I'll upload a Mediafire link of a blank tower server file in the description that will be an INI. And all you have to do is just type in the um, friend's Steam ID. And then if you want to add more friends, just do what I did with typing another line in. And it will be completely okay. And if you have any more issues, you can also contact me on Discord. Um, or you can just comment on the video. So now that we have that done, let's go back into Tower Unite and see if it worked. Alright, so now that we're back on the condo, you can look at my friend Saf and you can see that she has the condo admin tag. And unlike before, she's trapped in that jar, but now she's able to escape her boundaries by pressing no clip. Whenever she'll decide to do that. And, oh, yeah, <laughs> there she goes. <laughs> okay. And then if we go to the provisions over here, you can see that she has every single permission, and I didn't have to do that, it just automatically happened when she joined my condo. And uh, yeah, if you guys have found that video to be pretty uh, interesting or useful, then I would really appreciate a like or a comment. But if you don't want to, it's completely okay, you don't have to. And with all that aside, I hope you guys have a great day.